Hey little scholars, today we're going to learn our numbers and our shapes. Are you ready to learn with me? Okay, let's go. First up, we have the number one. Can you say number one with me? This is the number one. Number one, number one. Say number one. Number two. This is the number two. Number two. Number two, number two. This is the number two. Can you say two with me? Say number two. Number two. Number three. Now we're going to learn the number three. This is the number three. Can you say three? Number three. Number three. This is the number three. Number four. Number four. Say number four. This is the number four. Number five. Five. This is the number five. Number five, number five. Can you say number five? Number six. Number six. Number six. Number six. Number seven. This is the number seven. Say seven. This is the number seven. Number eight. 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 Number eight. Number nine. This is the number nine. Number nine. Number nine. This is the number nine. Okay, guys, number ten. This is the number ten. Say ten. Number ten. Number eleven. This is the number eleven. Say eleven. Number eleven. Number twelve. This is the number twelve. Number twelve. Number twelve. This is the number twelve. Number 13. This is the number 13. Number 13. Number 13. Number 14. This is the number 14. 14. This is the number 14. 15. This is the number 15. 15. This is the number 15. Now let's do number 16. Number 16. Number 16. Now let's do number 17. Number 17. Say number 17. 18. 18. This is the number 18. Number 19. 19. This is the number 19. Say number 9. 
Number 20. 20. Number 20. Number 20. Number 21. 21. Number 21. Number 22. This is the number 22. Can you say number 22? Say number 22. 22. 22. This is the number 22. 23. 23. This is the number 23. 24. 24. This is the number 24. 25. 25. This is the number 25. Say 26. 26. This is the number 26. Number 26. 27. This is the number 27. Say 27. 27. 28. This is the number 28. Say 28 with me. 28. Good job. 29. This is the number 29. 29. Say 29. 29. 30. This is the number 30. Say 30. This is the number 30. 30. Okay, scholars, now let's learn some fun shapes. A circle. A circle is round. Can you say round? The circle go round and round and round and around. The circle is round. And you know what else is round? A clock is round, a clock is round like a circle, and the sun is round. The circle has no corners and it has no edges. The circle is round. A triangle. A triangle has three sides. The triangle has three sides. The triangle has corners. Do you see? The triangle has three corners. If you have a slice of pizza and you cut it from one corner to another corner, you will have two triangles. The triangle has three sides. A diamond. A diamond has four sides. A diamond has four equal closed sides. Do you know what is a shape of a diamond? A kite. A kite is the shape of a diamond. Remember, the diamond has four sides. The diamond has four sides. The diamond has four sides. One, two, three, four. An oval. The oval is a rounded shape. It's not quite like the circle because the oval is elongated. That means it is stretched. So instead of 
around it is long so the oval is a rounded shape the oval looks like an egg have you seen an egg before have you ever looked at an egg the egg is the shape of an oval the oval has no corners and the oval has no edges because it is round the oval is round and elongated okay guys good job rectangle the rectangle has four sides the rectangle has four sides it has two long sides and two short sides two long sides and two short sides the rectangle has four sides the rectangle has four sides the rectangle has four sides say four sides the rectangle has four sides two long sides and two short sides the rectangle has corners and edges. A heart. This is a heart. A heart is the symbol of love and kindness. I love you. A heart is a symbol of love and kindness. The heart is red. A star. Stars aren't just in the sky, but stars are a shape with five points that twinkle and shines. Like twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are stars this star is yellow this star has five points and one fun fact about a star is that the star is used for a symbol of bravery yes are you brave and strong the star is used to represent bravery are you a brave kid Yes. This shape is a cylinder. A cylinder is like a can. It has two circular faces and a curved surface in between them. Did you know that a can of soda is shaped like a cylinder? Yes. A can of soda is shaped like a cylinder. This shape is a cylinder. Say cylinder. This is a cylinder. 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 Good job. A pentagon. This is a pentagon. Do you see that point at the top? The pentagon has five sides and five angles. Look, it shapes like a house. This is a pentagon. Say pentagon. This shape is a pentagon. This shape is a pentagon. Do you know that the Pentagon building in Washington, D.C. is shaped like a pentagon? Yes. The Pentagon in Washington, D.C. is where important decisions are made to help and keep or people safe. The pentagon. This shape is a pentagon. Look at this shape. This shape is a semicircle. It's a half circle that's formed by cutting a whole circle into two halves. So the semicircle is a half of circle. It is like a big round pizza. If you should cut that pizza in half, you'll get a semicircle. So a semicircle is a half a circle. 
it's a half of a whole circle that is called a semicircle it has one round side and one straight flat side a semicircle can you say semicircle this is a semicircle this is a cross a cross is a shape with two lines that meets each other at the middle and form four equal sections. A cross is a symbol of hope and faith for many people around the world. This is a cross. Say cross. Say cross. This is a cross. This is a crescent. A crescent, a crescent. This is a crescent, a crescent, a crescent. This is a crescent. A crescent is a shape that looks like a curved moon. Have you ever seen a curved moon before? It looks like this, a crescent. Trapezoid. A trapezoid has four sides and two sides that are parallel. The trapezoid is like a rectangle that is being stretched out. Did you know that the roof of a house can be shaped like a trapezoid? Yes. It helps the rain and the snow to fall off of it easily. Trapezoid. This is a trapezoid. This is a trapezoid. This shape is a trapezoid. Say trapezoid with me. Trapezoid. Trapezoid. This is an arrow. The arrow is straight with a pointy end. This is a arrow. This is a arrow. Look at the picture. Sure, this is a arrow. This shape is an hexagon. A hexagon has six straight sides and it has six angles. The hexagon has six sides. The hexagon has six sides. Say six, say six. The hexagon has six sides and six angles. It was so much fun, little scholars, learning about all these amazing new things. Until next time, bye bye, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. We'll see.